only four years after the nuclear disaster at Fukushima, the energy corporation Electricité de France, or EDF, wants to build two new nuclear reactors in Great Britain, thereby creating one of the world's largest nuclear power stations at Hinkley Point in England. However, this project can be financed only through massive subsidies. That's why EDF got the British government to give a guarantee of over 21 billion euros for its construction. Plus, for the next 35 years, a guaranteed feed-in rate of around 11 cents for every kilowatt hour of nuclear power. Plus, adjustment for inflation. According to calculations by the Financial Times, this will equal about 35 cents in the final support year. By comparison, a large solar power plant in Germany earns barely 9 cents these days. This is a clear violation of EU competition law, as the British government well knows. For this reason, it applied to the EU Commission for an exception. At first, the reaction in Brussels was troubled. The energy commissioner at the time, Gunther Oettinger, even called the financial benefits Soviet-like. And yet, after some negotiations, in its second-to-last session, the then-officiating EU Commission suddenly gave approval for financial aid for nuclear power, after all. This decision throws the door wide open for the construction of new nuclear power stations in Europe. Sebastian Sladek of Elektrizitätswerke Schönau is determined to prevent this. The EU Commission has set a precedent here that could lead to the breaking of the dam. In Great Britain alone, 10 further reactor blocks are being planned. And with high subsidies like these, other nuclear power stations in other countries will follow. The Austrian government has announced that it will file suit against this decision with the European Court of Justice. To lend more weight to this lawsuit, however, support from all across Europe is needed now. We at Elektrizitätswerke Schönau have decided to bring a complaint directly to the EU Commission. But that alone is not enough. So we've set up all the arrangements so that you and a maximum possible number of citizens can easily join us in this complaint. Please, everyone, I invite you to join in. Support our campaign and help us stop new nuclear power stations from being built in Europe. Every European citizen has the right to file an official complaint against this decision. But only if the pressure from the citizens becomes greater than the influence of nuclear lobbyists will we be able to bring the newly appointed EU Commission to revoke this bad decision. Take part in our complaint and join us in demanding no money for nuclear power. Stop Brussels. To participate, visit our campaign page at www.ews-schernau.de slash campaign.